What's going on, ladies and gentlemen? My name is Dylan. Welcome back to the channel. Hopefully, each and every single one of you are feeling fine and fantastic. Today, we're joined by the one and the only, Tanya. Hello. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is season three, episode one of Friends. This one is called The One with the Princess Leia Fantasy. Okay, that's very interesting. Let me guess it's either going to be Joey <laughs> or Chandler. <laughs> You'll it's be gonna... surprised. <laughs> or maybe it's someone else. Uh, so you you said you'd be surprised so it's not them there you go or it can be everyone mm. but what does it say the, the one it's not a plural the episode the one means the episode with the layer the princess layer fantasy so why didn't they just call it the episode because they're all called the one you so know why that. not call it the episode <gasps> look for when uh, they call message the message the, the the people that created friends and ask them they all call the one the one the one means the episode the episode the episode yeah you're, you're so easy to literally wind yes because it annoys me every time no wonder why on the main channel the comments are just drive you insane huh I can't. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. This is episode one, like I said, of season three, brand new season. We have 455 more episodes to go. So no, I hope no, you enjoy not it. Not that many. Not that many? No. I've almost finished uh, Avatar. I'm oh, a few episodes away from finishing season two, and then I have season three, and then that's it. Oh, you still have one season, so yeah, season and a half I have of of Avatar: The Last Airbender. So, mm -hmm. anyway, guys, without further ado, let's jump into this. Let us know in the comment section who your favorite character is. As always, remember to hit that subscription button down below, and if you can go check all these episodes out in full, they're over on Patreon. And now, let's do it. Let's go. That girl totally winked at me. Did not oh, wink at you. Again? Huh? <laughs> Look happy tonight. It hasn't been your day with your mom, or even your ear, but I'll be there for you. <laughs> Are you Tanya today or what? Because you're there for me too. <laughs> I'm not singing. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> <laughs> I was doing what Tanya usually does to me. <coughs> Sorry, I'm sick. I can't laugh. <coughs> or I get coughing attacks. <coughs> I. Oh, God. Sorry. Uh, people Poor. getting blown up around the world. You're dramatic about a cough. No, I'm just saying if I laugh, I cough. I'm not being dramatic about anything. The most romantic song ever was The Way We Were. Uh, see, I, I think the one that Elton John wrote for um, that guy on Who's the Boss. Um, Hold me close, young Tony Dianza. Hi, Ma. Hi, hey, Ma. Uh. Hey, Good. It's like you today. Oh, my God. Has she slept at all? No, it's been three nights in a row. Yeah, she found one of Richard's cigar butts. Okay, that explains it. I got a call at two in the morning. I could hear it was like this high squeaky sound, so I thought, okay, so it's like a mouse or a possum. What? So you, you get calls at 2 a.m.? Uh, and you think, okay, it's a mouse or a possum. <laughs> I mean, uh, it, it is Phoebe. Oh, Let's no, just say, guys, it great. is bloody Phoebe. Just remember that. No, <laughs> oh, great. my God. Where would a mouse or a possum get the money to make the phone call? Money. Not the fact that a mouse or a possum can actually make a phone call. It's the fact that they found money to make a phone call. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's what's weird about it, okay? Exactly. Oh, God. Hey. You made pancakes? Like there's any way I could ever do that. Monica and Rachel had syrup. <laughs> Good morning, Joey. Good morning. Good morning, Chandler. Why don't you stay home from work today and just hang out with me? I gotta go see my lawyer. I'm going out with somebody who's getting divorced. I'm such a grown-up. I'm such okay. a grown-up. Not without a kiss. Well, maybe I won't kiss you and then you'll have to stay. Kiss her. Kiss her. <laughs> See you later, sweetie. Bye, Joey. Bye-bye, Janice. Kiss her, kiss her, kiss her. So when Joey's, uh, Joey is uh, a little bit jealous. Oh. Yeah. She's taking Joey's man. Yeah, exactly. You're dumping him. Not this time. Come on, quit yanking me. I'm not okay. yanking you. <laughs> yeah. This is Janice. She makes me happy. You look me in the eye and tell me you're not breaking up with her. No blinking. I'm not breaking up with her. 
I found in the drain. It's some of Richard's hair. What do I do with this? Getting it away from me would be job one. Yeah, exactly. I mean, this is like all I have left of him. Drain hair. Oh. Aw, why would you throw it in his food? What the? Oh, it looks like, yeah. like a tiny little person drowning in your cereal. <laughs> nah. God, nah, what is I wrong with me? Cereal. You need to get some sleep. I need to get some Richard. You broke up with him for a reason. And I'm tired of wondering why he hasn't called. Why hasn't he called? Maybe because you told him not to? What are you, the memory woman? Chandler and Janice, they're not breaking up. He didn't blink or anything. I mean, have you seen them together? They're really cute. Cute? You remember Janice? She's annoying, but you know what? She's his girlfriend now. I mean, what can we do? That's the spirit I'm looking for. What can we do? So I say we all just be adult about it and accept her. There you go. Yeah, we'll call that plan B, all right? <laughs> It sounds like a good plan, to be honest. I was wondering... I'll be throwing that pad and pen away. Do you still have that, um, navy uniform? I had to return it to the costume place. I think I have an old band uniform from high school. You remember not having sex in high school, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you have any fun, you know, fantasy-type thing? No. Bloody Ross, of course it was Come Ross. On, you gotta have one. You know what? That you was said, funny. You said Joey and Taylor, you could never guess it was Ross, was it? Now I'm thinking about it, I should have said Ross first. <laughs> because, yeah. Anyway, other things. Uh, I know why it would have been Ross, yeah. But the thing is, someone actually... A, a lot, okay, let's just say, a lot of males that are Star Wars fans, they have told me that in the comments or messages or Patreon or even in real life, They've told me that they fantasized over Princess Leia. Really? And in one of the scenes, and it's the famous scene because yeah, I of think, this. Yeah, I think the one where I she's asked. where she's laying, like provocatively in some really attractive clothes. Yeah, I know yeah? which one it is. Yes. Yeah. A lot of people have fantasized. Maybe even some females out there don't know, but a lot of them have fantasized about Princess Leia. And <laughs> Yeah. Well, Rose is one of them. <laughs> usually, usually when you see people get married, one person dresses up as a per, uh, like, and it's a Star Wars theme. One dresses up as Leia, and the other one dresses up as um, I don't know, whoever Darth Vader or whatever. I don't know, but it's always Princess Leia. Yeah. Who, who else can it be? There's a couple other female yeah. characters as well. Yeah. I can't remember their names, but... <laughs> See, they're not that important. Princess, because all I remember is Princess Leia in those scenes because I was getting a little bit flustered myself. I might do it. <clears throat> okay. Did you ever see um, Return of the Jedi? Yeah. That's a Do you remember the scene with um, Jabba the Hutt? Jabba had as, as his prisoner Princess Leia. She was tied up uh, and laying side on yeah. Princess Leia was wearing this um, gold bikini thing. gold yeah. <laughs> Yeah, oh, Princess Leia in the gold bikini. Oh, every guy our age loved that. Really? Mm -hmm. mm. That's the moment when, when, you know, she stopped being a princess and she became, like, you know, a woman. Did you ever do the, the Leia thing? Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Ooh. <laughs> that, that great. Oh, no, it's just that I got this new pager. And Tanya, you're doing the Leia thing. No way. You're doing the Princess Leia thing. No way. <laughs> wait, wait, she's got a pager and it's on vibrate. Oh, I've got to hear this. I have it on vibrate. <laughs> I thought she was doing it to... <laughs> I thought she was doing it because she was picturing herself as Princess Leia again. Oh, my God. <laughs> I swear. Hey, look who I found staring at a parking meter. Come on. Hi. <laughs> Why aren't you at work? Because I don't work at the Szechuan Dragon. really need to get some sleep. They published my paper. Let me see, let me see. Great. Look. Ooh, hi. <laughs> That's what Leia's hair looks That's like. That's what he looks like. Oh, there is my strong Ross Skywalker to come rescue me. Oh, no. There he is. Fight, fight, Ooh. fight. Oh, what this guy's so stupid. It's Count Rushmore. Count Rushmore. You know, you Jesus should really Christ. go on this show. I got three tickets to the Rangers tonight. I'd say I am there. Is Ross going too? No, Janice. I just, I feel bad <laughs> for Ross. We always go together. Do you have a problem with Janice? Yes. Mm. God, how do I say this? Uh, you know the girl from the Greek restaurant with the hair? Ugh, drives me crazy. Oh, I don't hate Janice. She, she's just a lot to take, you know? Hey, Joey is right. She is a bit much. She is a bit over top, but at the end of the day, you got to realize that your friend is in love with someone and it makes him happy, and you should be happy that someone else is happy, but 
obviously he's too immature to see it at the moment yeah mm. oh what usually happens is they used to do everything together yeah that's what i mean yeah. and now someone else taking that spot yeah don't look at me like that she used to drive you nuts before too yeah well i'm crazy about her now i want you to say that you like her i can't every time she starts laughing i just want to pull my arm off just so i have something to throw at her thanks for trying by the way there is no count rushmore yeah then then who's the guy that painted the faces on the mountain <laughs> Her. Yes, I didn't think it would be that big a deal. That was supposed to be like a private, personal thing between us. Phoebe is my girlfriend, okay? We oh. tell each other everything. You guys do the same thing. That's different, okay? That's like, uh, who dated a stripper? Both of those, Joey? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you, don't, you don't talk about, like, you know, your girlfriend. Not even with your best friend? No. That is so sad. You're missing out on so much, Ross. Huh. So what, you tell each other everything? Pretty much. Did you... Talk about the night of five times? Uh, honey, yeah, that was with Carol. I know, but it's still worth mentioning, I think. Relax <laughs> every oh, muscle God. in your body. Listen to the you What? I need that. For what? What has happened to you? Relax. Oh my gosh. God. Play, 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 play. Pinky, plunky. All right, so. You're in a meadow. Do you think breaking up with him was a huge mistake? Okay, there are no questions in the happy place. The warm breeze and the moonlight flowing through the trees. I bet he's totally over me. I'll bet he's fine. All right, betting and wagering of any kind are, I'm sure, not permitted in the happy place. I would, rather, just, you know, the I would rather her not be talking and just listening to the music with the candles, yeah. No, but but it, not it, with her standing there. It's not. It's good to have someone talking while you listen to the music. It helps you focus. They call it uh -huh. ma mantras. <laughs> yeah, look for it on YouTube. You play mantras and you have people telling you, relax, close your eyes. <laughs> now. Mm. Do this. No, I'm sorry, but it reminds me of ASMR. Oh, God. What? <laughs> it reminds me of someone just sitting there talking into the mic. <laughs> Making all these weird noises. Oh my god! I would rather listen to the, or rather listen to the, to the soft music, and just float away. No, because with the soft music, you think about all the stuff. But if someone talks to you, you focus on what that person's telling you to do. The lovely waterfalls and the the, the trickling fountain. Okay, this isn't working. I'm still awake, and now I have to pee. Oh. <laughs> so I hear. You hate me. I never said hate. Very careful about that. A little birdie told me something about you wanting to rip your arm off. You got a hate from that? Fine, 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 fine. So, this is my idea. You and me spending some quality time together. For Chandler. Okay. Joey and Janice's day of fun. It'll be a whole day. It's how long it takes to love me. Oh, I sleep in the next room. <laughs> so, down to the post office. Oh, it turns Jesus. out it was those videos that I ordered. Love the Civil War. Monica, do you want us to take you home? Uh -huh. What should you or maybe to a galaxy far, far away? <laughs> 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 Bloody bastards! We oh. that was he talking about his fantasy yeah. to her now, so she was just giving him crap. <laughs> uh. <laughs> Women tell each other everything. <laughs> Did you know that? <laughs> stuff you like, stuff she likes, technique, stamina, girth. Why? 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 Is that what women do, Tanya? What's girth? How big your willy is. Ah, okay. I've never told anyone. Have that. you told? Have you told anyone about the things you do? No. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a liar. I don't talk about that stuff. Other people do, and I'm like, really? Do I have to listen to this? I don't care. No, I don't like that stuff. I don't like to talk about that. But yeah, other all, all, all women do. Yeah. <laughs> Trust me, they do. It's like, uh, okay, you give me. I didn't. I didn't like really. Rea I didn't realize. Like, <laughs> it's funny because when me and my friends used to talk, or um, when I had friends. When we, <laughs> we but I had friends. Talk. When nice we times. used to talk, all right? When we used to talk, we used to talk about like I don't know the most weird stuff, yeah, like the color of our poop or something like that, yeah, just some weird random stuff. 
and you have women there talking about other men what, what they've done and everything like that we don't as males we don't really talk about it we just say it once later yeah i i went and you know had blah 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 with that woman that's it yeah with that with this girl yeah that's it we don't talk about full depth details or anything yeah but that was we, like we literally that, talk more in depth detail about going to the bathroom like that episode when rachel and rose kissed and they like oh tell us the details and the, the girls and she's like oh he helped me with his yeah. arms and that's then exactly what he it did is this, he did that. Yep. and then the boys is like i kiss rachel tom yeah. yes cool <laughs> yeah. yeah that's exactly what it's like that's exactly what it's like <laughs> oh, that was so good why would they do this? Rachel says sharing's great. And so, you know, we ought to be doing it. Uh, do you want to? <laughs> <laughs> We're not going to talk about girth, are we? No. <laughs> yeah. You go first. So, uh, the other night, Rachel and I are in bed talking about fantasy. And I happen to describe a particular Star Wars thing. Princess Leia in the gold bikini. Yes! <laughs> Yeah. Well, that that was easy. <laughs> okay, you you go. Okay? <laughs> okay. Well, you know, you know when you're in bed with a woman, huh. you know you're fooling around with her, and you get all these like mental images in your brain. Uh, that girl at the Xerox play. Belly button ring. Oh, oh my God. God. And all of a sudden, <laughs> your mom pops into your head, and you're like, M Mom, get out of here. <laughs> That's good. You know, but of course, like after that, you can't possibly think of it. No, no, no. Remember this. Remember this. Good important. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I should reveal something what? on camera. What? Do you have fantasy with your mom? No. Um. No. <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you? <laughs> One good way for a man to last longer. I was going to sound weird. As heck. I'm not going to say it. It's to think about your mom. No, it's yeah. to think about grandmas. Ah, grandmas. That's it. Well, some people may love grandmas. I don't know, but... For me, it's grandmas. There's always something a male does to last that a little bit extra longer. And that there you go. That's a tip. That's a tip for you. Oh, and in this case, is that... This his, is his weird. Pro his problem grab, is I've, that his mom gets into, into his head and he can get... So his mom takes the head of the girl that he's in bed Jesus with. Jesus yeah? Christ. And then he can think of anything else. Well, That's listen, I've heard about... I've, I've heard about males that try to choose females that are similar to their mum and females choosing similar males to their dad. I've heard those sorts of things. So I don't know if it's no, true no. or not, but no, no. I've heard about that and I've heard the reason why men love breasts and, and things like that because literally they were born sucking on them. I've heard basically, literally, I've heard that's the reason yeah, why. I don't but know. I don't know. Anyway, there you go. Anything else, and you can't, you know, stop what you're doing. So it's kind of like you're. <laughs> no. You're telling you're telling me about, about your mom. What is the matter with you? You said I said share, not scare. Go <laughs> sit over there. Go sit over there. Maybe that's why males don't. <laughs> with that, Go sit song. over there. I'm gonna tell you that more often now. Go sit oh, over there. Good. Joey and Janice's day of fun. Really? And, uh, you know, I love this woman. You have got competition, buddy. You a kiss? Mm. I'll see you later, sweetheart. You too, Chandler. <laughs> <laughs> He's lying. You still can't stand her, can you? I'm sorry, man. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, I appreciate you giving it a shot. The good thing is, is that we spent the whole day together and I survived. I guess that's something. Now I know I can stand to be around her, which means I get to hang out with you, which is kind of the whole point anyway. Okay. We stopped by the coffee shop and uh, ran into Ross. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> if it makes you feel any better. I do it too. Really? Oh yeah. I always picture your mom when I'm having sex. <laughs> <laughs> you bloody prick. Look at that face he just gave him. You guys can't see it. Look at this face. Where is it? You guys can't see it. Look at that face. <laughs> Jesus, that's a face that I'm gonna kill you, you bastard. I'm gonna bloody kill you. 
April 12, 1861. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, far out. Hey, Dad. What are you doing here? Well, it's your mother's bridge night, so I thought I'd come into the city for a little monocuddle. Since when did you start smoking cigars? I just like the smell of them. What are you really doing here, Dad? Well, I just wanted to make sure that you're okay. I saw Richard. So, how are you doing? Just a little tired. I'm okay. <clears throat> How's Richard doing? You don't want to know. Well, he's doing terrible. <laughs> worse than when he broke up with Barbara. The man is a mess. Well, do you think he was waiting till after you left so we could cry? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Honey, relationships are hard. Like with your mom and me. You know, after we graduated from college, we broke up for a while. Her father, your grandfather, wanted her to travel around Europe. Like, however... Okay. Huh? She went to sleep. It's not just her feeling the pain. <laughs> Mission accomplished, boys. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jada's prisoner, and you have a really weird look on your face. Like, what is it? Did I get it wrong? Did I get the hair He's wrong? Picturing his Would mom. Just picture it differently. What? What? N no. What is it? Come on, sweetie. You're kind of like freaking me out here. I hate Chandler. The bastard ruined my life. <laughs> well, 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 well. There you go. Any fantasies that you have? No. No. Any that you have? You've never told me. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No fantasies at all. I literally had told you everything. Um, what I'm gonna say about this episode was it's it's really interesting because that guy thing is is such a truthful thing. I don't know how much truth there is in the female bit, but with guys we. We talk about the most random stuff that we we literally don't even give like information. But that's the thing. It's with us males. It's like even though I express myself and I'm emotional, you guys see Tanya sees it too. With males, you don't show that emotion. It's like you can't show to other males that yeah. you are yeah, weak, exactly. yeah. isn't it? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's 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 such a weird thing. And you guys may think, oh, that's not the way you should be, or you know what I mean? Like you should be more open with each other. But it's like literally when you're with other males, it's like it's like being in a room with a pack, and you know what I mean? Like one of you have to be the alpha male, yeah. And that's what it, that's what it's like. <laughs> No, I'm so, I, but I'm dead serious. That's what it's like. I don't want it to be like that, yeah, but that's what it, literally what it's like. And even if you say, like, certain things are cool, they'll be like, really? What the heck is wrong with you? Like, You know what I mean? Like, sort of things like that, uh -huh. yeah? Or or males will just, we'll just pay out on each other and give crap to each other about everything. The shoes we wear, the, the, the shirt we wear, or, you know what I mean? That's just what males do, yeah? It's just what we do. We just... We literally, that's what we're like. All of us are like that, yeah? Okay. And sometimes I've even been like that, yeah? Where it's just like, I'm cracking the most random jokes about the most random things I do half the time anyway. But Yeah, you you do that a lot, yeah. I don't know what it's like with, with, with females, the conversations between females, because obviously I haven't been in there before. But. No, I've, re I've realized that people, usually other women don't talk about certain things about me because they know I don't like it. For example, all that, all this stuff about sex and things like this, they mm -hmm. don't talk about it when I'm there. But none of my friends, I don't really talk about that with anyone. But then I see them talking about it to other people. So yeah. I suppose they've tried, because it makes me feel embarrassed, to be honest. And I suppose they've tried and they've seen my face when I'm like, really? So that's why they don't talk about it anymore in front of me. But then it's like they find all the other females to talk about it. Like, oh, 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 well, let me tell you something. And I'm there listening like, really? Mm. <laughs> but there, I, I feel so, so embarrassed when someone talks about that in front of me. It's like, it's too personal. You don't have to share that with all the people. <laughs> like, well, it makes me think like, what the heck do you females talk about for you to be like that? I don't know. 
Because, uh, like I said, us males, we just we just say, yeah, yeah, we slept with her. That's it. We no, don't go into no, full, no, depth full, detail, full like depth detail, like the direction we put it in, the the counterclockwise or, you know what I mean? Yeah, like yeah, yeah, all that. Clockwise all that. or anticlockwise. All that, all that. Is the, that. The degrees that it was with temperature <laughs> as it was in. So we don't talk about that stuff. Well. We don't talk we about, do. yeah, I was uh, biting my ear at the same time. Yeah, yeah, and then you go um, 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 and, 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 and head bump each other. <laughs> yeah, exactly. We just go, ooh, ooh, chugga, chugga. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's how we, we talk to each other, as man. No, but um, sometimes it's good, though, as uh, as this episode has pointed out, sometimes it's good, sometimes it can be bad because they put weird images in each other's heads, i.e. Chandler's mum. <laughs> But it's 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 also really good for males to communicate in a, a lot more because males don't really communicate as much as as females because females are a lot more open, yeah. Yeah. And males are too. They they won't show it, but a lot of them. If even if you're listening at home and you say, oh, "I'm not scared to do it," you're you're literally scared because you're saying you're not scared to do it. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. But literally, ninety-five percent of the males that I know won't talk about certain things. Who come out with certain things that I don't know they want help with with their mental state or or their health or well-being yeah, yeah. at all because they're just they're too scared to to be soft. Yeah, mm. and I think that's a horrible way to be. And I think that's why a lot of males struggle mentally and the suicidal rate in males is so high because that conversation's not there. Maybe. And that's a real important thing is to have that conversation because a lot of males aren't able to go out and seek help because they don't want to seem like, you know what I mean, they're weak. Mm-hmm. And that's a simple fact because males have got testosterone and you know testosterone makes you do the most stupid things. Well, yeah? look at the cat. <laughs> well, that's what I mean. Our cat hasn't even been neutered yet, this sex yet, what? and his testos- testosterone is all, all over the bloody but place. He, he does weird things. Head butts walls, yeah, he head butts he doors. So many weird things like tries that. to make love to Tanya's clothes and all sorts of bloody things. And it was humping on my pajamas yesterday. Yeah, that's what you said. Try to make love Again. to your clothes, and it, it makes testosterone makes males do weird things. It makes us do weird things. And one of the things being is that we, a lot of us are too proud to talk about those certain things that we don't want to open up because we're scared that the other male is going to give us crap or uh, our friends are going to give us crap is what happens. Whereas if female opens up, they talk about it with each other because maybe they've experienced themselves, yeah? But the other male has probably experienced it but doesn't want to show that oh no i'm not weak as well i'm uh-huh. not gonna do it you yeah. know what i mean whereas it, it's stupidity it's absolute stupidity because like i said if males talked and opened up a lot more it's so much better for mental health it's so so much better uh-huh. and that's why that's why when males have partners it's so it's so good to 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 open up to be open to them and tell them so many things because it is a female yeah mm-hmm. or it is your partner yeah it More literally like that, yeah. yeah it is your partner yeah it is your partner you can uh, open up to them yeah and it's so important to have in a relationship that that communication because it's very very key to get frustrations out talk about everything mm-hmm. and it's that's why for me personally that's why a lot i think a lot of people when they get into relationships they push their friends to the side because when they needed help or when they needed someone to talk to their friends weren't there but their partner was so they feel like they have more of a connection to their partner than their friends you know what i mean so for me personally i think it's very very key to for males to talk to each other a lot more not in depth detail like females do (laughs) about certain things but just a bit more yeah mm. good advice uh, i enjoyed this episode i really did enjoy this episode and it, it's it's cool to see someone well it's not cool but it's good for them to show someone like monica 
how she went through the down period of a breakup and then realizing with the closure that oh i'm not the only one feeling this pain Mm -hmm. and then she fell asleep straight away (laughs) she fell asleep because she realized that okay i'm not battling this alone there's someone else feeling my exact pain okay i'm calm now you know no, because I mean? it's also like oh, you feel you feel stupid, and you think why why am I feeling this way? But then you yeah. f- know that the other one's feeling the same, and it's normal. So yeah, it's the only reason why they broke up because they she wanted kids. She wants to have children. Yeah, she's got to remember she can't be sitting on the sofa crying all the time and missing out and having kids because that's why she split up with him anyway. Yeah. Exactly. So, <laughs> all right, guys, let us know what you think down in the comment section down below. I hope you enjoyed this episode. We're going to hop into the next one, episode two, right now. Go check it over on Patreon. Go check all these out over on Patreon. If you're not on Patreon, what the heck are you doing? You're missing <laughs> out. I honestly don't know what you're doing if you're not on Patreon by now. You guys get videos daily, like non stop daily, and it's literally for a minuscule fee, guys, for a couple of couple of euros, depending on where you are around a couple of euros. Literally you'll pay the same for a coffee in the morning. Yeah. It may be even more depending on where you are. Just go over to Patreon, go have a look, guys, and you get it for the whole month for minuscule fee and you get videos daily, T V series and movies daily. Go check it out, guys. I'm being dead serious. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to get into the next episode. We'll see you there and enjoy the rest of your day. Take it easy. Bye. Bye.